Have you ever wished you could accomplish more in your day? Why is it that you can only do the amount of work that you can do? What if you could compress a whole day's work into one hour? Is that even possible? Well, I believe it is. And right now I'm running a small experiment to prove that's the case. When I worked on a team building an online store for a UK supermarket chain, one day the management decided to take the whole team to a venue in the countryside to spend the whole day planning. I remember our team leader explaining exactly what we had to do. With all the user stories for the product we were building laid out on the table in front of us and a big whiteboard with a slot for month one, month two and month three, she asked us to plan what we were going to get done in the next three months. Well, after much debate about each of the stories and how long they were going to take, we ended up with something like this. All that work was neatly allocated between the three months that our team leader had written on the board and pretty much everyone was satisfied and patted themselves on the back at a good day's work. Well, I don't know whether anyone else was thinking it, but I couldn't help but blurt out the fact that all we'd done is taken the work that had been allocated to us and split it evenly between the three months that were available. Hilarious. I felt like a bit of an asshole, to be honest, because I didn't really have a solution. But the key takeaway for me from this experience is that the work always expands to fill the time that's allotted to it, which is crazy when you think about it. Why does that happen. Think about the kind of development work that you do. You're not building widgets on a factory assembly line. A lot of what you're doing is dealing with ideas and things that don't have a single fixed amount of time to complete. It's all subjective. What's more, unlike pumping out widgets in a factory that all look exactly the same, the kind of work that we do, it's a matter of opinion whether the quality is good or even whether it meets the acceptance criteria. What this means is that the amount of time for the kind of work that we do, delivering a feature, building an entire product, it's malleable. That means that the amount of time it's gonna take can change based on the story that we tell ourselves. If I tell myself that this user story is gonna take an entire day to complete, well, guess what? It's gonna take me a whole day. If I give this to you and you tell yourself it's gonna take one hour, guess what? It's a user story that takes you one hour. And yes, there may be problems that crop up along the way that prevents you completing that in an hour. But the main thing to bear in mind is that the time work takes to complete can expand and contract based on the idea of how much time we think it takes. Reason I'm thinking about this is because of what happened yesterday. We need to talk about yesterday. You see, yesterday I was making another video just like this. And because I didn't really have anything else planned for my day, you know what I did? I woke up in the morning and started thinking about ideas for my video. Jotted a few ideas down on my laptop and then went out to a cafe. Started working on some thumbnail ideas, ideas for my video title. Then I went out for lunch. After lunch, I logged on to the restaurant Wi-Fi and and continued working on some thumbnail ideas. When I got home in the afternoon, I thought, great work, I'm gonna start filming a video. Made myself a nice cup of tea, got myself ready, which took a while, made myself another cup of tea, and started filming, which didn't go to plan. I think I spent about two hours filming for what ended up being an eight minute video, and I wasn't even happy with the results. Not only that, but I spent four hours editing, and by the time I'd finished my video, it was 8 p.m. I'd basically filled my entire day with creating one eight minute video that even I know doesn't take that long, because I've made similar videos in just a couple of hours before. So I woke up this morning and realized what I'd done. I basically told myself I've got a day to do this and guess what? The work expanded to fill the time allotted to it. So have you noticed this in your work? Whether you're in a job or building your own project, is there anything about the work that you're doing that means it has to take as long as it takes? What if you told yourself that rather than that work taking a day, it's gonna take an hour for no reason other than the fact that you've decided that it's so and you know that this kind of work we're engaged in is malleable. 16 minutes. Well, that's exactly what I'm doing today with this video. I'm running an experiment to see whether I can create a video similar to yesterday's that took 12 hours, whether I can do it in just an hour and a half. 
So I'm giving myself only 30 minutes to film this, 30 minutes to do all the editing, 15 minutes to work on a thumbnail and title, and then 15 minutes to upload and review. Because I believe, I know that I can do this video in an hour and a half. And the crazy thing is that I'm not even sure that if I spend an hour and a half on it, it's gonna be any worse than the video that would come out if I spent a whole day on it. Because actually, as we spend more time on a task or a project, we end up just polishing, tweaking, and spending forever on things that at the time we think are important, but don't really push the needle forward. If you're watching this video, then you'll know that this experiment is a success because I'm being strict on this, because I wanna get this done and free up the rest of my day to make some important improvements to to a web app of mine. So just think what else you could achieve if you could redefine how long certain pieces of work take. Could you run a small experiment just like this to even prove that something could be done in 50% of the time? If you could do that, maybe you could get double the work done. Or maybe you could take the afternoon off because work always expands to fill the time allotted to it. This video is proof of that. So the only question is, what story are you gonna to tell to yourself about how long your work takes? 22 minutes, we're ahead of schedule.